All right, I did a second flight, but the camera wasn't focusing, so that was good, which is uh, fantastic. This camera shouldn't do that. Well, this will be the third flight now with this drone. We're just testing it out here, out in Winthrop is where we're at right now. This drone's a lot faster than the last one that got ran over, you guys saw on the channel. Figured uh, I'd post something, because right now it's been kind of slow with uh, wedding work and some other stuff. I have a gig coming up this weekend that I'll shoot. It's uh, for like a meat company, meat processing company, and uh, that'll be out in Ellensburg, which will be pretty cool. I don't know if I'll post it to the channel, but I've been doing real estate stuff too on the side. And then I also started a uh, gaming YouTube channel strictly just VR, because VR has impressed me so much, like virtual reality wise. It's really next level gaming. So I started a gaming channel. So like on the off times that I don't do anything on this channel, I'll post some stuff to that here and there. But that kind of correlates with what I do here too. I mean, these goggles are essentially kind of like wearing VR goggles in a way, even though these are the most uncomfortable goggles I've worn. I need to get new pads for or something. DJI needs to step the game up and kind of like help the majority, the vast majority of us out with the light leaks and the nose and stuff. But this will be uh, flight number three and I'm just gonna rip around, cruise up the mountain again. Um, but I guess I just wanted to fill you guys in. I wanted to post something to the channel at least, know that I'm still here and I'm waiting for the drift season for this guy. Some of them, some, some buddies are still drifting and stuff right now currently, but um, not, not my main buddies like Steven and Cody and those guys that I follow, but um, yeah, let's uh, let's rip again. Let's get her going. Almost cut my fingers off earlier. Uh, changing this battery out. The strap that I have on it is such a pain in the ass. Hopefully, it didn't damage anything. There's not much left battery on this GoPro here, so I'll try to boogie real quick. Oh, I just woke up from a little nap, a little dark, but you guys silly. I'm still gonna send it. And this mic doesn't want to stay. Has like a little. I'm testing out the Road Go wireless mic. And these little fuzzies also, terrible design. They should have done like a 90 clip-in versus the, what they have currently for these little fuzzies on top. All right, let's fly, dude. Oi. Unlocked. <laughs> kind of took off a little weird there. I don't know if I messed up my trim or something. Right now just cruising around the yard. I was chasing them earlier on the snowmobile. I'll probably show some of that. Even though the footage got kind of all out of whack with the camera that I'm using. There's me standing right there. And we'll just kind of cruise on by. This drone is hands down legit my favorite drone I've built so far. DJI has come a long ways. Definitely a cool little spot. Ripping through the trees. We'll go up over here. I'm losing signal just a little bit, but it's not too bad. I can go pretty far with this drone. Kinda dive down into these trees a little bit. I can't see very well with the shadows. It's definitely way better than my other drone. That is 100%. Cruise through here. But yeah, I've been playing a lot of VR games lately. Kind of ties in with this since I'm wearing goggles on my face. It's kind of fun. Essentially, that's why I started the VR channels, just to pass the time. 
keep up my editing skills in a different different way you know This is just a cruise sesh, no tricks. I don't want to mess up. We'll do that when we're at home in like a field or something. I don't want to land it in the snow and fry the board. That'd be bad. We were actually here last year. I wanted to make a video of me flying my other drone. That was the one that got ran over. But, uh, I freaking jacked it up pretty bad. I put the props on backwards. Rookie mistake. <laughs> it was terrible. Drove it right into the, right into the gravel and uh, burned one of the motors up try to replace it with a soldering gun, but the soldering gun that I bought at the store that's around here is terrible. Hopefully my camera's in uh, focus on me. The GoPro probably died by now, which is kind of sad. This Rode Go wireless mic is actually really cool. I use it for the VR video stuff when I'm gaming. It's uh, pretty neat how it works. Uh, I'm gonna use it next weekend for the video with the meat company that I'm doing social media stuff for. It's cool that it's not corded. You can just clip it right to your shirt. No problems. You can even throw a lapel mic in it, which I have Rhodes lapel mic that I probably use, even though this sounds okay, as long as it's concealed pretty good on the person. Right now it's just on my chest, on my bibs, but battery limit's pretty uh, scarce. But yeah, that's it. That was sick. Hope you guys enjoyed just hanging out and chatting for a little bit. I know it's something different, but we'll get that GTR video going now that we have this, you know. We'll see what happens with that. I really want to get that going, but we just, it's been kind of hard with both of our schedules and weather, obviously. Um, but yeah, so I will uh, catch you guys later. Peace out.